everyone, I'm Josh from sunny California and welcome to English with Josh 365. In this video, we are going to describe different ways to tell people that you're hungry in English. Let's get started. I'm starving. I'm starving is used when you haven't eaten for a while. When you are starving, you are craving food and want to eat right away. You can't think of anything but food. Example, I'm starving. I have not eaten since yesterday. Time to eat. Time to eat is used when it's around the usual time to eat. People will often ask if it's time to eat because they are starting to feel hungry. Example, is it time to eat because I'm starting to get hungry? Expect to use this phrase a lot around lunch or dinner. Grab a bite. Grab a bite is used when asking a friend to get food. This expression is one that I use a lot. It's a nice casual way of asking someone to go get food with you. Example, let's grab a bite after work. This is also a good phrase to ask someone when you are hungry and not familiar with the area. Example, where can I get a bite around here? Hungry as a horse. Hungry as a horse means you are really hungry. This is also another way of saying that you are starving. For anyone who has been around horses, you know that if you leave the food out, they will eat it all and never stop eating. That's where this idiom comes from. People will use this phrase to explain why they ate so much. Example, I did not mean to eat so much, but I was hungry as a horse. Work up an appetite. Work up an appetite means to develop the feeling of hunger. This phrase is used a lot when we are talking about exercise. Example, he worked up an appetite after going for a morning run. You may notice that after you exercise, you often get hungry. That is working up an appetite. Stomach is growling. Stomach is growling is used when you feel physically hungry. As you know, sometimes when you have not eaten for a while, your stomach growls. So when you tell someone your stomach is growling, you are telling them you are hungry, usually because you have not eaten for a while. Example, I could hear my stomach growling. People often say this when their stomach actually makes a noise, a noise that sounds like an animal growling. Sweet tooth. Sweet tooth is used when you want something sweet or sugary to eat. After I eat a meal, I always have to have something sweet. This means that I have a sweet tooth. Example, my sweet tooth is craving some strawberry cake. Notice the use of the word crave. Crave means you have a strong desire to have something. People with a sweet tooth crave sweets such as candy or chocolate. Hollow leg. Hollow leg is used to explain why you have eaten a lot. Someone with a hollow leg is a person who has eaten more food than you would expect. It's sort of a joke. The word hollow means something inside is empty. So if you have a hollow leg, that means the inside of your leg is empty, which would explain where all the food went. Of course, this is just an expression. Example, I can't believe you ate so much. You must have a hollow leg. Let's recap what we learned today. Maybe you went for a run today and worked up an appetite. Your stomach is growling and you are wondering if it's 
time to eat. You call a friend to go grab a bite because you are starving. You end up overeating because you are hungry as a horse. Since you have a sweet tooth, you end up eating a huge slice of chocolate cake. Your friend is amazed with how much food you have eaten and asks if you have a hollow leg. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. I encourage you to use the expressions you learned today the next time you are hungry. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more videos on learning English. And let me know in the comments below what expression you liked best. I'll see you in my next video.